Now, here's what's interesting about dark matter. We know it doesn't interact with us, except gravitationally. By the way, what do I mean by interact? D does it bind and make atoms and molecules and solid objects? No, it does not interact with us in any important known way. But it also doesn't interact with itself. That's what's interesting. So if it interacted with itself, you can imagine finding dark matter planets, dark matter galaxies. Because to interact with yourself is what allows you to accumulate and have a concentration of matter in one place versus another. These are the atomic bonds and the molecular bonds that create solid objects. And if particles do not interact with one another, they just pass through, you just have this zone of mass not really doing anything interesting. 